this owl box has inhabitants, but I'm not sure who is in there. <laughs> so we're gonna find out. Oh my gosh, look at how much propolis there is. I could tell it was packed is because the entrance is just thick with propolis. Hi. Yeah. Oh, it's dripping everywhere. Probably some avocado orchards nearby. Ooh, yummy. Oh, they've killed them in the past. Not these owners. They just bought the property, but all the wax moths, uh, that means it was abandoned at one time or exterminated, probably just exterminated. But they're actually pretty mellow for being in an owl box. And for being this old. Yeah. Some really dark honey. Ooh, that looks rich. Oh wow, yes. looks like jam. Yeah, look how dark it is. Whoa. How is it? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh we have found it. <laughs> <laughs> it's the unicorn, honey. <laughs> you have to try this, Bill. Okay. Mm. Breakfast. <laughs> a pretty pattern. Yeah, you can see this is very typical of a beehive. They put the honey up top and then the larva down low. Mm -hmm. Sometimes just kind of pollen in between the layers. Yeah. Sometimes when the bees move in, the owls move out and occasionally that means having to leave behind some eggs and some young. So you can see there's a couple unhatched eggs here and uh, obviously some hatched ones. And bees will make the owls move out because these are just kind of gnarly and the owls don't want to deal with them. We're looking for the queen. Still haven't found her yet. can see her. I see her. Wait. Yeah, she's small. Can you see her? She's pretty small. 